Good morning, everyone. Corinne from Mama's Little Lambs. Hopefully, everybody's having a great Wednesday. I know I am. I know that means that we're at hump day, and we only have two more days to the weekend. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you a subscription box that I purchased for my daughter, and I'll be back to let you know what it is. Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a subscription box that I got from my daughter. She is in 8th grade. Um, she will be in ninth grade next year and I just wanted to get her a little more involved with a little more detail with art. And she is very talented, very creative. She loves drawing, um, painting. She does pastels. She does watercolors. She does um, chalks and uh, watercolored pencils. So I wanted to find something that she would really enjoy. And I came across um, a subscription box and it is called Let's make art. And I have to tell you, this is amazing. And I love it for more than just one reason, um, outside that it is outstanding and there's some, so many great things. And I think the subscription box is going to be awesome for her. This box, you can get a subscription, which is $45 for the month, which comes with three different, or I think it's four different um, activities for you to do each month. However, I decided to buy the kits and the kits are $15 each and you can buy one or you can buy as many as you want. I decided to go with three for the month because I felt that that would get us through a month and a half and then we can see how we feel about it and kind of go from there. So I'm going to show you what I purchased, what comes in here. I did purchase a couple extra things just because they were things that we did not have and I wanted to get those so that she would have everything she needed when we were going to start. So let me open this up, kind of turn it around a little bit. I'm going to show you what we got. She absolutely loves jellyfish. So we are going to do this. And it gives you step by step of what you need to do to create the jellyfish. So this was one of her favorites. So without a doubt, I knew to definitely, um, I didn't know if there was anything on the back, but there isn't. And then you get a postcard of exactly what it's going to be. And if you want to send this to someone and then give them a copy of what you've completed, that's absolutely fine. So it takes you through all the different steps. There's six steps to go through and it tells you what brushes to use, the color to paint, and it comes, each one, and I'll show you those as we go along, comes with everything you'll need in able to create this um, painting. So this is the jellyfish. The next one we got was the floral truck. Now I have to say, I want to show it to you this way. It's so pretty. This was one I picked for myself that I want her to create for me. I just love the old trucks and this this color. I don't know if, what you would call this if it's like it's not, it's not a teal, but the blue is so brilliant. It's not like a turquoise. It's kind of in between, but it gives her once again step by step what she will do. It gives her the canvas to start with. I am going to frame these, and like I said, this one I picked, and I'm going to pick put this in my setting room. Absolutely the colors I have out there. So this is going to work perfect. So I am very excited about this. The last one is another one of her favorite is turtles. She loves turtles. This is a sea turtle. And like I said, it takes you through each step. This is a card of what it should look like when she completes all her steps. And the thing, I don't know if you can see this. Let me kind of, maybe this way. If you look at this, it has the outline of the turtle, so she does not have to draw it, and each one will come with that. That's the first step, and then it'll tell her what, how to color it, what paint color she's going to need, what brush sizes, and each step will take her closer to getting to the picture of the sea turtle. 
So I like that. I forgot to mention that to you because it starts with an outline. It's a real fine outline, but at least you have the outline. So that's really helpful. Each one also came, each one, and it tells you which one it is. So this is a sea turtle, and here's all the paint that you're going to need. And then, of course, the other two. Here is the floral truck and the jellyfish. And like I said, they come with the little paint, all the ones that you're going to need. And this is enough to do the whole picture. I did not have the brushes. I did not have a two and a six. And those, um, all three of these pictures called for that size of brush. So I went ahead and, I don't know if you can see those or not, but purchased these. I also got with this, which I thought was really cool. Open this up here. I this is what they use to um, for their for their paint, and this is what they use. Now she does have this one, you know, the palette. She does have the typical one, but I really liked how they did this. I think this worked a lot better. Um, for blending and everything. I don't know if I probably should let her take that off, but I liked this. It's kind of like a tin, and they used this, and they showed how they used it, and it has a tutorial, so you can go through and watch the video. Um, so I did purchase this separate, like I said, and the pens. Everything else for $15, you get the paint, and so you would get the sea turtle, and then you would get the paint that came with it. So everything comes with it that you need to complete this piece of art. And like I said, there are three in there. All the paint came. So I am so excited for her to start those. I also purchased some other things for her. Um, some of the things I had laid out. So the first one is watercolors. And these, I do believe there are 12 different ones in here. So she can also use these. Um, she has water, watercolor pencils. She does have some oil pastels. And there are several different colors in there. I did get her the solid watercolor cakes. And they're, like I said, once again, there's tons of colors in there. And here's some more brushes. They came with that paint set that I just showed you. These are really cool. These are, um, let me pull these up and out. These are really neat. These are a paint inside a brush that's so already filled and it's all set to go. So she can use these to work on other projects and I'll show you the book she has to do that. Um, these are, these have the, the reservoir and you can fill them with water. So if you want to paint, go on it. If you're on your nature study and you're out, you can fill this with water so it's already ready to go. It has different size brushes, so whatever one it calls for, you can do that also. This is a premium watercolor pencils, and I didn't open it because it's new to her. But it's a beautiful set, and there's 36, I don't know if you can see that, 36 different colors. The last thing that I purchased to go along with her kit is Everyday Watercolors. Learn to paint watercolors in 30 days. And it just shows you, it takes you through steps um, and goes through and just gives you different pictures and flowers and just so many different things, petals, um, trees. And it gets you a start on how you want to apply and how much you want to apply and the brush sizes that you need. And it just really builds your confidence. And I'm really excited for her to get started on some of these. We'll also be using her, um, we got a Charlotte Mason nature journal. And she will be painting in that and drawing. And it just goes through, gives you techniques, tells you colors, talks about different colors, talks about all the different steps you want to take, talks about the different types of painting, doing curves and circles. It talks about... Um, going through and if you want it, your different strokes that you're going to use and just techniques. So this is just a fabulous book and it's quite thick, like I said. So there's just several, several different ones she can do. And it, it has like a little outline of a drawing. So it kind of tells her how she needs to start that. So we're excited to do this um, and just make some beautiful. I thought this was really pretty. Kind of reminds me, you know, Arizona desert. Um, just beautiful. And then the whale. This is kind of unique. 
So I liked that. So she's going to be working with this um, besides doing her other um, kits. She will work on this also. And then also our Charlotte Mason um, journal to work on. So I was so excited to, like I said, to receive this. And we are going to be getting started. And we will do this. We do poetry tea time. So opposite Fridays, we're going to make art. And I will do a follow-up video to show you the three products that, that she is going to create and do when they're finished and how I displayed them. And I thank you for sharing your day with, uh, with us and um, letting me share with you this subscription box. I hope that you have liked it. If you have, give me a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, go ahead and hit subscribe and hit the notification bell so you will know when I am going to be putting up a new video. So I'm excited for Ava to get started. And also, um, I look forward to making more videos. And if you have any comments, please leave them below. If you have any suggestions, that would be awesome. And thank you again for sharing this day. And may God richly bless you.